All right, Stone, you guys broke through the other night, Thursday in Washington. It seemed like a really big win, able to carry that momentum uh, tonight. What was the key? I mean, it was the same thing. You know, Washington was a big time win for us. We've been in a couple close games and we were finally able to punch one out. And we just did a really good job preparing for this game. You know, we were able to, you know, you celebrate that one, but you also know that on these road trips, it's really challenging. So you have to kind of lock into Washington State. They play a completely different style. Our coaches prepared us well and we were all, we were all locked in. Well, speaking of locked in, you have been locked in. You started now, I think, five straight games. It seems to have opened things up for you, but really the team, kind of a four out, one in. Yeah. Team has really been play, uh, playing well with you in that position. Yeah, no, I think it's, uh, you know, it's just great, the guys that we have. You know, we can offer a lot of different looks. And then, like you said, you know, the four out, one, one in, I think it opens Zeke up tremendously inside, you know, that they can't really trap when you have four shooters on the outside. So it just makes it a, it makes it really hard for the opposing teams. All right, Brian Brigger, the equipment manager for the team, the Emoy, as they yeah, yeah. call him, right? So he came out this week. He had ordered the Kobe Fives, yeah. you know, like a month ago. Yeah. Just I yeah. think it was just on, on intuition. They yeah. came in this week. He was able to bring them out to the team. If we go down yeah. and show the Kobe Fives down here, you guys all wearing the new ones. Yeah. And yeah. it's been kind of interesting, fun for this team to be able to honor a guy that a lot of these players probably deem as their favorite player growing up. Yeah, of course. Especially, I mean, we have so many guys from the Southern California area. You know, everybody idolized Kobe growing up. And you idolize him for different reasons, even if you're not a huge Lakers fan. You know, his work ethic is unparalleled. It's something that I try to you know, implement in my daily life, whether that's with athletics, academics, or, you know, anything really. I just always want to be the hardest worker. I don't know. I can't imagine me coming close to Kobe just from some of the stories that I've heard. I need a little bit more than two, four hours of sleep a night. But, you know, he's great and the shoes feel great and we're glad that we got him. Well, great job and congratulations on this road trip. Thank you so much. Yeah.